Have you ever felt tingling, burning, or numbness in your hands or feet? Maybe you've noticed sharp stabbing pains or a pins and needles sensation that just won't go away. If so, you might be dealing with peripheral neuropathy. This condition affects millions of people, and while it can be frustrating and even debilitating, understanding what causes it and how it's diagnosed and what treatments are available can help you take control of your symptoms. Hi, I'm Dr. Knapp, family medicine physician here to bring you medical information so you can take control of your health and make the most of your doctor visits. Let's get started. Peripheral neuropathy refers to damage or dysfunction of the peripheral nerves. These are the nerves outside of the brain and spinal cord that control movement, sensation, and even automatic functions like blood pressure and digestion. Because the peripheral nervous system plays such a vital role in everyday life, any damage can lead to a variety of uncomfortable and sometimes serious symptoms. There are many different reasons why someone might develop peripheral neuropathy. One of the most common causes is diabetes. High blood sugar levels can gradually damage nerves, particularly in the feet and hands, leading to diabetic neuropathy. People with diabetes often describe numbness, tingling, or burning pain that worsens over time. Another common cause is nerve compression or trauma. Injuries from accidents, repetitive motions, or conditions like carpal tunnel syndrome can damage nerves, leading to pain and weakness. Certain infections such as Lyme disease, shingles, or HIV can also cause neuropathy by directly affecting nerve tissues. Autoimmune diseases such as lupus and rheumatoid arthritis can lead to nerve damage due to chronic inflammation. In some cases, the body mistakenly attacks its own nerves, leading to symptoms of neuropathy. Additionally, vitamin deficiencies, especially a lack in B vitamins, can contribute to nerve dysfunction. These nutrients are essential for nerve health and without them, nerves may become damaged or function improperly. Other potential causes include exposure to toxins such as chemotherapy drugs, heavy metals, or excessive alcohol use. Chronic alcohol consumption can lead to alcoholic neuropathy, which causes numbness, pain, and muscle weakness due to nerve damage. There are also genetic conditions like charcot marie tooth disease that can cause neuropathy, although these are much rarer. Identifying the underlying cause of peripheral neuropathy is essential for proper treatment. Diagnosis often begins with a detailed medical history and physical examination. A doctor will ask about symptoms, medical conditions, lifestyle habits, and any medications being taken. A neurological exam will check for signs of nerve damage including muscle weakness, reflex abnormalities, and changes in sensation. To confirm a diagnosis, several tests may be used. Nerve conduction studies and electromyography, or EMG, are commonly performed to measure how well the nerves are transmitting signals. These tests help determine the extent of nerve damage and whether the problem lies in the nerves themselves or the muscles. Blood tests may be ordered to check for diabetes, vitamin deficiencies, autoimmune markers, or signs of infection. In some cases, imaging studies such as MRI or CT scans may be used to look for structural problems like herniated discs or tumors that could be compressing nerves. In rare cases, a nerve biopsy may be performed to examine the affected nerve tissue under a microscope. Once a diagnosis is made, the next step is management. Treatment depends on the underlying cause. If diabetes is the culprit, controlling blood sugar levels is the most important step in preventing further nerve damage. Lifestyle changes such as maintaining a healthy diet, regular exercise, and taking prescribed diabetes medications can help slow the progression of diabetic neuropathy. For those with neuropathy caused by vitamin deficiencies, supplementing with the necessary vitamins like B12 can often reverse or improve symptoms. If an underlying autoimmune condition is responsible, medications that reduce inflammation, such as corticosteroids or immunosuppressants, may be prescribed. Pain management is a crucial part of treatment. Over-the-counter pain relievers, such as acetaminophen or ibuprofen, may provide mild relief, but for more severe pain, doctors may prescribe medications like gabapentin, pregabalin, or certain antidepressants, which help alter the nerve signals to reduce pain perception. I just want to take a moment to ask that you hit that like button and subscribe to my channel. 
Leave a comment below if you have any topics or questions you want covered in future videos. Anyway, in some cases topical treatments such as capsaicin cream or lidocaine patches can be applied directly to the affected areas to provide relief. Physical therapy can also be beneficial, especially if muscle weakness or balance issues are present. Exercises and stretching routines can help maintain mobility and reduce discomfort. Some people find relief through alternative therapies such as acupuncture, massage, or transcutaneous electrical nerve stimulation, or TENS. While these approaches may not work for everyone, they can be helpful additions to a comprehensive treatment plan. For those with severe neuropathy that significantly affects their quality of life, more advanced treatments may be considered. Nerve blocks or spinal cord stimulation can sometimes provide long-term relief for chronic neuropathic pain. Managing peripheral neuropathy often requires a combination of medical treatments and lifestyle adjustments. Avoiding alcohol, maintaining a balanced diet, staying active and practicing good foot care, especially for those with diabetes, can help prevent complications. Checking the feet daily for cuts, blisters, or infections is essential since reduced sensation increases the risk of unnoticed injuries. Peripheral neuropathy can be challenging to live with, but understanding the condition and taking proactive steps to manage the symptoms can make a significant difference. If you're experiencing tingling, burning, numbness, or pain in your extremities, don't ignore it. Early diagnosis and treatment can help prevent further damage and improve your quality of life. Thank you for watching. As always, take care of yourself and make the most of your day.